What's up, XCOM fans and fellow gamers? We are going to save the Mexican city of Leon, which I've never actually heard of, from alien assault. And it looks like there's new aliens. Let's go kick some alien ass. We're going to be putting down in Mexico for this mission. Mexico. We've gotten reports of alien activity taking place in a densely populated urban center. We should move to secure the area and minimize further civilian casualties. Minimize. Okay, mission brief. Alien terror attack in progress. Strong civilian presence. Take care to avoid civilian casualties. Failure will have severe political consequences for XCOM. Mission objectives. Approach civilians to enable evaluation. Evacuations. Enable civilian... Well, minimize civilian casualties. Neutralize all hostile targets. All right. Launch mission scouter. See my Goliath coming off of there. That'd be nice. Central, this is Big Sky. Confirm signal uplink. Strike team is in position near the terror site. Ooh. Awaiting confirmation. Solid copy, Big Sky. Strike one has been given the green light. Your highest priority is to protect those civilians. Oops, I'm the wrong button. Now zoom out with G. All right, I can see four vigilians. I can see four. Civilians, vigilians. Uh, all right, Congo, get over there and help her. You're safe. Now get moving. All right. Can you get to her? Him? Run for it. Get to the ship. All right, my little alien, my little robotic bud. Let's get you in there. Alright, you keep an eye out for me. There's something out there. I hear you. Alright. There's another one. Shh. I think I heard something. Alright, well you're gonna dash over here my assault trooper. I think my ship can handle itself. Whoa, no, no, no! I lost two civilians! Do you have any shot? Wait, if I move over here, does it mean to rescue both of them? Do it. Look sharp. Enemies rolling up. Crap. Go. Get out of here. <laughs> Holy Christ, she is. Alright, well, take him out. Are you kidding? A 90% no chance. Yeah, no freaking way that just happened. There's a 90% chance. No, 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 do not run a gun. Yeah, I'm just gonna kill him. Kill him like there's no freaking tomorrow. Dead and gone. Shot. Good. 82% chance. 
Alright, yeah. I'm about to start keeping score. Sweet. Right there. Hoorah. Yeah. Hoorah's right. Come on. Oh, right there. I Just call the target. I call bullshit donkey on that. Well, that's not good. Kill him. Kill him. He's down. Need a resupply. This negates any hope we oh. have of establishing a clear pattern of behavior among the alien species. This specimen is nothing like the others. Seems like they've got one of everything. All right. What can you do? 91% chance? Hell yeah. Adjusting sights. Are you fucking kidding me? Ready to engage. Okay, flake him by coming back here? Apparently not. Kill him. Kill confirmed. Die, you little bastard. Are you my medic? Yeah, we're one of my medics. No, 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 I don't want you dash. I don't want you to get over here. Uh, heal wound. Come on, time to cowboy up.
Oh, what would have happened to my screen? Uh. Go, you're safe. Go. <laughs> Oh! No. Huh? 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 little robotic buddy. Keep there next to him. Let's rescue him. You're, sh you're gonna shoot the hell out of him. Excellent work. All objectives complete. Yes. Only lost three people. Ah. Oh. Well, I lost three civilians. I didn't lose any of my soldiers. Fantastic. This is on normal, by the way. This is not on easy. I might still lose because of the panic level things. ammo confers plus 100% damage against robotic enemies rapid confers a second reaction shot if an overwatch and the first reaction shot you know what? I'm gonna do that that sounds pretty nice I don't see too many robotic enemies so far rifle barrage things on a target granting uh, revive Yep. Psycho. No. Adds one damage on critical hits for each enemy the squad can see. Confers a reaction shot against an enemy who closes to within four tiles. Oh. Oh, well. Bring him on. Oh, that's... Oh, no, 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 no. That's actually kind of hard choice right there. Close combat specialties. Oh. I'm going to go with close combat. I guess some autopsy, weapon fragments. Decrease. Decreased. All right. Good. 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 Remember, we will be watching. How's things going, though? I'm sure the troops will be eager to get out there and even up the body count. Okay. Russia and Germany are still wigging out on me. I need to get money. What's the date? All right. Well, maybe I can get. Okay. Um, mission control. Scan for activity. Sign new research. Okay. Scatter laser available for manufacturing. Laser sniper rifle. Ooh. Ooh. The scatter. Oh, 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 that's like a shotgun for lasers. Capable of inflicting considerable damage. Power accuracy suffers greatly. Oh, the laser sniper rifle. Provides a greater chance of inflicting critical damage to enemy targets. Oh. Oh, that's so beautiful. So beautiful. Yeah, I'll begin. I'll, I'll do the autopsy. Based on what we've seen in the field so far, including several grotesque examples of trauma resulting from the emergence of its young, we've taken to calling this specimen a chrysalid. Chrysalid. Hmm. Interesting. All right, let's get back to mission control and scan for activity. Yeah, thermal generator. I got some power now for the steam vents. My base is coming. Thermal down. generator online. Yeah. 
Okay, after years of research and study, until now I had never encountered something that is quite as beautiful yet equally as deadly as this species. Unlike the other aliens we've encountered thus far, it is it is anthropodal in nature. Plated in a sleek black exoskeleton. The, whatever. Okay, plating for manufacturing. Woo! Light plating made from cr chrysalid exoskeleton. This material provides additional protection and significant reduction to melee damage sustained. Alright. Should I do the power source? Heavy lasers. Plasma pistol. Light plasma rifle. Now I'm going to do a skeleton, skeleton suit. Engineering. Our worst suspicions may have been true after all. They're not just here for abductions. They have something else in mind. Hmm. And it's niche. I can't build anything. I have no money. <laughs> Engineering. Build facilities. I need to build a satellite nexus and get some freaking satellites in the air. Come on. Incoming transmission. We are extremely impressed with the progress of the XCOM project thus far, Commander. Your recent results were beyond our expectations, and that is not a statement this council makes lightly. Good. Good, good. 455 bucks we plus will three be in scientists. touch, Commander. Fantastic. Alright, let's get down to engineering. The new engineers arrived this morning, Commander. We're always glad to have more help down here. Alright, I need to build a freaking satellite nexus. I can't build a satellite nexus. I don't have enough money. And I don't have enough alloys. Should I just build a satellite uplink? Okay, well I can build all kinds of this stuff. I don't want to worry about that skeleton key yet. Well, if I build that, that's the only one I'm building. Let's see how many of these I can build. I can build one. Okay, what about laser rifles? I can build one. It all comes down to those alloys. Yeah. Uh, you know what? I kind of need that body armor. Manufacturer. I think I need three of them. Yep, dispatch items. All right. I sent out the nanofiber vest and I got three engineers for it. Um, the new engineers arrived this morning, Commander. We're always glad to have more help down here. I bet you are. Oh, yes, 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 yes. Approved med kits. Shoot suppression. The foundry is already warmed up. I'll make sure to notify you as soon as production is finished. I have insufficient funds to do it. Alright, good for me. Use soldiers. Nope, 
uh, yeah, loadout. Get him that better armor. He's uh, one of my new. He's one of my major guys. Saquon Psycho, Casino Demon. Nice. Bonus. All right. I'm my Goliath. I love my Goliath. Oh crap! I forgot about that. I could have increased my squad size. Uh, can I sell stuff? Sectoid corpses. No, I'm gonna, I'm gonna sell that many. Sweet. All right, now let's go to uh, barracks. Officer training school. And let's get the uh, squad size in first. Sweet. Now I can have six. All right, scan for exit. Yeah. Skeleton suit. Nice. The skeleton suit is our first attempt at combining medium weight body armor with integrated grappling hook for scaling objects in the field. Nice. We're gonna do the heavy lasers. Alright, situation room. Nope, not situation room. Mission control. Let's scan for activity. Yes! I can't do anything else. Nice, 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 nice. My shiv is even better. Wait, do I have to go to barracks and uh, do anything with that? Nope. Yes, heavy lasers. Heavy laser available for manufacture. Laser cannon available for manufacture. Shiv laser project available in the foundry. What? The heavy laser requires a supplementary power supplies that makes it somewhat unwieldy in combat, but it is capable of dealing high amounts of damage. Shiv laser. Now that we can produce high output laser weapons, we can swap out the conventional minigun on our shiv units currently used in favor of a laser cannon. Whoa. Laser cannon. These super cool laser cannons can take down most alien craft, but they have a limited range of carrying the requiring the interceptor to close in on hostile targets. Well, aren't you just fancy? Alright, you have the UFO power source. Now let's get down to engineering and go to the foundry. I have no money. That's the problem I'm running into. I'm running into having no money. I got this. I don't want to sell it though. I really need some satellites. Commander, we're detecting a new contact. Much larger than anything we've previously encountered. I recommend we scramble our best equipped fighters if we're going to engage that ship. I don't have a good equipped interceptors. I've been basically ignoring the whole We're in pursuit. Thing. Enhanced targeting system. if he has better luck. Enemy is padlocked. 
Satellite assist acquiring targets. Yes! Got him! Commander, our fighter is down. We've lost contact. Oh, I'm sorry, man. This is gonna be fantastic. Alright, got two of them. Got my laser, him. Alright, he's set. Goliath, I got my sniper. Head it, Union. Loadout, how are you doing? I don't have any of those things. He's got a scope. Hmm. I'm good. Let's go. I just took the thing down. I don't have any interceptors. I have no money. I am dirt freaking poor. <clears throat> Dropship has arrived. Alright, let's get that alien ship. We're heading into China for the next operation. It looks like the aliens went down in a sparsely populated area. If there are civilians in the area, I hope they stay clear. Okay, mission brief. XCOM interceptors have splashed a UFO. Intel indicates some surviving crew. Exercise caution when engaging the enemy. The craft may contain usable salvage. Locate the craft. Mission objectives. Locate the crashed UFO. Sweep the area of surviving crew and neutralize them. Avoid additional damage to the craft if possible. Some components may be recoverable. Oh, that is a big ship. This is Big Sky. We're just north of the crash site. Strike 1 is in position to engage. Loud and clear, Big Sky. We'll monitor those readings from here. Strike wow. one is authorized to assault the alien craft. Wow. Well, fellow gamers, that's going to be the end of this episode and the end of my gameplay, actually. So, I hope you have enjoyed it so far. I'm going to continue. Don't worry, that didn't mean I'm not going to stop this series. I'm going to keep going. It's my most successful series of all the channel of all the videos I have up on YouTube right now. Uh, please remember to like, subscribe, leave comments down below, tips, suggestions, strategies for you, my, myself and other people who watch this. Any ideas? Um, please remember to share. Just let people know about this channel. I really appreciate how much it's grown in the past just couple of days, really. Past, past few days. Um, and all my new subscribers and viewers... I thank you all, and I really do appreciate the likes and subscribes. It brings a smile to my face. It really makes me happy. It just, when I have a shitty day, I look at this, and I'm like, oh, look at the, oh, I got more subscribers, and I got no comments, and more likes, and I'm like, yeah, thank you so much. And until next time, my fellow gamers and XCOM fans and just YouTube viewers in general, I wish a grand old happy day, good day on all of you.